Hey, welcome. It's Camping Cast with Smith RV in Casper, Wyoming. We're going to take a walk through a 2023 Jayco Jayfeather Micro 166 FBS. If you got a smaller vehicle, don't want to get anything big, and want something lightweight, this might be something you want to look at. So it's 4,000 pounds dry, 5,000 pounds grossed out. Uh, so a lot of things will pull this trailer. But a lot of great uh, options on this. It has the off-road package on it. So we have the flipped axle. It has 16 inch wheels on this thing, which is pretty amazing. We have rock rails on this thing too. So if you're looking to go on some uh, two tracks, some backcountry roads, definitely it was gonna be a lot better than the average travel trailer. So we have solid steps on board this thing. Got a little LED accent lighting there. We have Jayco's two year front to back warranty, third year limited structural warranty. No one does that. That's the best warranty in the industry. We have tinted uh, windows on board. And you can bring that TV from inside out. We have our bracket here, 110 outlet cable hookup. We have our fresh water fill here. 55 gallons of fresh water on board this thing. That's a ton of fresh water uh, for a uh, 19 uh, feet, eight inch travel trailer. That's a lot. So back to those uh, tires real quick. We have Goodyear uh, tires on board this and we have metal lined wheel wells. So if you like, uh, like a lot of people love to do all of your cooking outside, we have the J-Port system, we have the bracket, and the capital 17 inch uh, griddle. So great way to uh, do some cooking. And you're gonna be able to quick connect that to the propane source right on the trailer here. So you're not gonna have to bring the little green bottles or anything like that. Now we do have a, a refrigerator on board. Now this is 110 as you can imagine. So um, if you're off the grid, you know, maybe you would think about putting a, a hunk of dry ice in there and maybe a little tray for the water drip. At least it'll do something for you. So we have some pass-through storage, so it's super wide on this side. We are lighted on both sides. And so we have uh, Lippert's uh, rock solid uh, stabilizer jacks on board this. Um, and just as they represent, they are super solid. Definitely different than your classic scissor jack. Um, really firm up the coach. It's pretty amazing, really. We are prepped for a monitor system, so if you do like to see down each side of you and the back, we are prepped for that. Coming around the front, we have diamond plate on the bottom, so it's gonna be a great stone guard uh, for you guys. We've got some nice accent lighting. 30 pound propane tanks. Got power tongue jack, and Jayco's been doing the uh, powder coating on these frames, so they're not going to rust for, for for a long, long time. We have an inset battery rack on board here, so you can set two deep cycle batteries uh, in there that we're going to set you up with. Coming over to the utility side, so we have a Furion. Uh, on-demand uh, tankless water heater. So that's going to do a great job at uh, getting all the hot water you need. All right, coming back over here, we have an outside shower, city water connection, black tank flush on that. So that'll do a good job of rinsing out that tank. Now under here, we have a sewer hose holder and our dumps. They're all nice and labeled black for the black tank, gray for the gray and those colors match on the handles as well. All right, coming around to the back side, we have a matching spare tire on board this. Super nice. Telescoping ladder to get to the roof, and then we're prepped for that backup camera on the back. You guys are ready? Let's go walking. Okay, before we go inside, I almost forgot one thing. Let's check out this telescoping ladder on board this thing. So it's mounted on the back. You bring it over here to this side, Hook it on the bracket up there, and up the ladder you go. If you guys ever watch my videos, you always know I love going up on the roofs of trailers. But they make it pretty decent. So, um, and here we are. Right, here we are on the roof looking at the Furion air conditioner. 
Overlander Solar Package, all sitting on the strongest roof in the industry, Jayco's Magnum Trust Roof System. inside the Micro 166 FBS. So let's take a look at this thing. So we can see that our solar controller, we saw that big solar panel up on the roof. We have USB ports and 110 here. And then we have a jackknife sofa. So we have a few different options. So if you want a little casual nap, this thing is actually pretty long. I'm six foot three um, and can, uh, you know, reasonably comfortably lay here. Obviously I'd want a pillow or something. We can sleep across. We can flip this down to hang out. Have our drink cup holders there. Or bring in the kids along or, or friends or whatever. We do have sleeping for two if you guys wanna get cozy. So it's obviously not a huge sleeping surface, but this trailer could sleep four people if you had to. So while we have this down here too, we have a uh, freestanding uh, plastic table that comes with this from Jayco and it's in a little built-in holder back there. So that could be for a few things. You could bring that outside with you and do some outside camp cooking. You could set that in front of here and have a little place to eat. So, so storage wise, got cabinets across all of this. So quite a bit of storage up there. And then we go up here and we have, we got a power tower. So we got two 110 outlets, uh, USB and the type C port down there. We got our queen bed and I'll just give you a reference point here. Uh, pretty decent room um, here. So obviously I need some pillows here to kind of bridge this uh, gap here with the wood, but pretty good room here. Storage all the way across. And then down below here, kind of got these ottoman slash storage devices. So we have two of these here, so you can put stuff in there. You know, or if you wanted to remove these from the trailer, you do have this open area under here that you can maybe put something larger. So you got some options there, but whatever you do do there, we also have like a little safety strap. Okay. So coming up top here, we have a 32 inch uh, HD TV. Now this is a real combo unit here. It's got a built in sound bar, radio, Bluetooth, kind of all wrapped into one. So uh, pretty, pretty cool stuff there. We have two sizable drawers and check this out. So storage is always super key here. Uh, so we just release that, open this up, and you have a ton of hidden storage, removable shelf there. Uh, great, great feature. We have a three burner cooktop here, a Furion cooktop. You can lay this down, so it gains you some more counter space. And then one large uh, deep drawer for pots and pans. Another drawer below there. They also give you another kind of pots and pans drawer. Good size in there. We've got a 110 outlet and we've got a Jayco bottle opener. Got a little sink there. And so I kind of touched on the solar package a little bit, um, but I did want to also let you guys know that this is inverter prep for five different locations in this trailer. So if you do want to do something, deeper than this solar package, you can certainly do so. So over here, we got kind of little pantry storage and our little uh, table trays that go in the cup holders. Some more storage down there. Now this is a six cubic foot gas electric fridge on this. So I'll run either way. All right, coming on in here, you see our nice little happy camper shower curtain. A little built-in shelf with towel, towel hooks, which is nice. We have a, it's plastic, but it is a foot flush commode. We got tower, towel holder over here. And let's take a look at our shower. So uh, my head is at the top of this skylight on this unit, but I think I can duck, duck down well enough and uh, hose off and do what I need to do in here. So, so be a little tight, but it's really not bad considering. 
It's uh, really a great bathroom considering this trailer is 19 feet, 8 inches overall in length. So hopefully you guys have enjoyed walking through the Micro 166 FBS. If you have any questions, um, if you want to holler at us, we'd love to hear from you guys. And as always, thanks for watching the videos. Uh, have an awesome day. Thanks.